Nautica. So yeah, uh, I've heard about this game. Never really played it because I didn't know if it existed on PlayStation, um, which is kind of dumb. I don't know. But yeah, we're going to try this game and see how we get on with it. So I've never tried this, um, and it'll be the first time I'm actually be trying it. So let's see, we got four game modes. So we got survival, crash land on a dangerous alien planet, scavenge resources, and manage hunger first, survive, freedom. Like survival but without hunger or first. Hardcore. Survival mode with only one life. No O2 alerts. Creative. Build anything with no constraints, oxygen, food, pressure, story, and death is disabled. Okay, we'll try survival because I think survival is the easiest place to start off with. So yeah, we'll see how survival goes. Alright, sorry guys, I'm just booting up stream real quick. I apologize. Yo, what's up, Jacob? How you doing? Yo, what's up, Bryce? How you doing, man? Hope you're having a good day. Yo, what's up, Dino? How's everything going, dude? It's going well, thank you very much for asking, Dino. Hope your day is going well, man. Sorry about like, getting the stream up a, a bit late there. But if you guys don't know what we're doing, we are basically trying out a brand new game called Subnautica. How's your day been, Rice? My day has been great. Thank you very much. What is going on then? Sounds like panic going on the ship. What is going on? We've we been launched out of a spaceship or something right now? What's going on? <laughs> oh shit bro, what's going on? Ah, oh, the fucking little plastic little um, board thing just knocked my guy out. <laughs> this guy just got knocked out by a little bit of plastic. Or metal, I don't know. What happened, man? Why are we in like a fire wreckage? Alright, so what we gotta do here then? Pick up fire extinguisher. Okay, excellent. R2 to use the fire extinguisher. Alright, there we go. Alright, so, what's this? Looks like all the systems are offline. You have suffered minor head trauma. I have suffered this minor head trauma. An optimal outcome. Bruh. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Okay, so press D pad to close or open your PDA. Okay, great. What's this? Open storage container. There's a flare in here. Take all this real quick. What's this on here? Oh, that's the video that she played. Okay, so se security test failed. Secondary systems offline, radio offline. Is radio really that necessary? Distress signal broadcast failed. Flotation devices deployed. 
Whole... Whole integrity, okay. Okay. Wanna play like Fortnite sometime? Uh, sure man. I think chat's a bit delayed a little bit, or maybe... Uh... uh I could do that or something. Cause I know Tyler likes it. Yeah, Tyler does like Apex. I don't really like Apex too much myself. Damage radio, use repair tool. Uh, I don't think I have a repair tool on me, so I don't think I can repair that. Use fabricator. What's this thing do? Okay, I guess we have to go up. So I don't think we can probably do anything at the moment. Zero human life signs detected. Okay, so I'm a little confused. What am I supposed to do from here? Let's see. Is there not like an objective we have to follow? Please refer to the data bank. Please refer to databank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Uh, what's the databank? Oh, here we go. Survival package. Minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the databank for detailed survival college, advice. Uh, Dina. Good luck. Okay, I'm a little confused then, so... How do I switch to my secondary item, which is the flare? Uh, is there an option to do that? Oh yeah, there you go. It's a D-pad button. Base corrupted. Okay, I'm a little confused what I've got to do here, so let's go back into the escape pod. Alright, let's have a look. Medkit fabric now. Okay, there's a medkit in here, that's handy. Storage containers, nothing in there. I don't think there's much we can do in here at the moment, so I guess what we have to do is go to that ship, which is currently in the water. Okay, so you can pick up items. Okay, that's good. So let's pick up these acid mushrooms. I don't know what the hell these will do for us. Riffling weed. What the hell do you do with that? Okay, I think what I need to do is probably figure out how to make some tools. Because it looks like we're going to need underwater tools. Arc limestone. Oh, never mind. I can break stone. Okay. What? Underwater type stone. Let's see then. Um, so I've got more acid mushrooms here. I don't know what the hell these are used for. It looks like I can only pick up certain things. Looks like an enemy from below may have just tried to attack me. 
I'm in college still, uh, you know. Alright. Let's see. Nutri block. What the hell's that do? Titanium. Oh, okay, titanium. Titanium ingot, silicon rubber, glass, bleach, wiring kit, computer chip. Okay, a battery looks like it can be crafted with this acid mushroom and a copper rule, which can be used to craft some wire. Disinfected water. Standard OZ tank, first aid kit, fire extinguisher, pipe, floating air pump. Are you okay? <laughs> you sound like you're breathing really hard. Okay, so I'm kind of confused what I need to try and do. Giant coral tubes. Okay, what's this? Sea glide fragment. How do I pick this up? Or do I have to have like a set of items to pick some of this stuff up? Eat something? Oh shit, it's time to eat something. I have nothing to really eat though. Yeah, I'm kind of confused what I need to do at the moment. I think you could maybe, maybe help me guide me a little bit. I'm a little confused. How do I catch fish though? I've got metal salvage, that's handy. That's something I could pick up. Uh, let's see. Table coral. Whatever the hell that is. That's acid. Creature discovered. Okay, we've got something called a peeper. How's this thing? Oh shit, it's dark right now. What what should I do, JJ? Should I stay in the hu uh, in the pod while it's dark, or do I go out? So stay inside of it. So I should stay inside until it's gone. Okay. Well, I'll put this little guy in the. Radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. What's it asking me to craft? Cooked peeper. Trend is con consistent with damage to the Oro's drive core sustained during planet fall. I'm a little confused. I've never really played so I'm not to really understand it much. But 
But everything that I'm getting right now will be great for the survival I need. So. I'm presuming I probably shouldn't go too down, f too far from this thing. So, um, real quick guys, how's everyone doing today? Is everyone having a good day? That's good, man. Oxygen. Yeah, I'm trying not to. I'm not sure what I need to do. I've got a lot of these acid mushrooms, so I don't know if I should get any more. The blue fish? But I, I can't, like, interact with it or pick it up. What do I need to do to pick it up? Let me see if I can find one. Here's one. I had a peeper for a second there, but I can't pick it up. Get back up for some air real quick. Oxygen. <laughs> New creature discovered. Okay, I've got I've got alien life forms. I've got something they called a bladder fish. Applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Not let me interact with the bluefish, so I'm not sure if I need like a certain object to pick them up. I'm not sure then. This thing? This thing is a bladder fish from what I can gather. I'll have to have a look at this more. Let's have a look. Unique outer membrane has potential as. Oh, okay. Cook your blood fish. Okay. Me. I guess they got tired of us. I think I've got too many acid shrooms. Oh wait, did I just eat the fucking fish? Oh no, I think I just did. Shit, I had the fish back with the accident. I think X is to eat stuff. What's this? Air bladder? Yeah, I will. Okay, it's, it's kind of daytime. Uh, what happens if I go to this massive shipwreck area then? It's like up here I need to get. Let's grab one of these peepers as well if I can grab one. Come here, you big dickhead. Oh, what the hell is that? That was that thing. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I can tell these things don't look too friendly. Well, they didn't attack anyone, though. Anything over here I should grab? Oh, it's metal salvage. Okay, so there's salvage over this way. That's good to know. Yeah, I don't know what I was picking them all up for. What's this? I found something interesting. It's a creature egg. How was that? <laughs> Oh shit. Don't you dare fucking. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. I'm going way too fucking. close to the fucking. Am I about to fucking die? <laughs> okay, I don't want to swim too far down, looks like. the crave side of this shell and see how it goes. As soon as I'm maybe not that experienced. As soon as I'm not that experienced at survival just yet, maybe I should try doing the crave side of things and see how I do with that. Oh shit. Yeah, I agree with that. I've been interested in this. Looks like there's nothing right down here. What's this? Grav trap fragment. Oxygen. <laughs> New creature discovered. Boomerang. <laughs> so there's literally a fish. There's literally a fucking fish put a boomerang. Right? Yeah, it's out of the earth, huh? This sounds pretty interesting. See if I can get it. If I, if I can't, that's fine. Well, they still got the secret vehicles too. But like. So it looks like I found I some fish. I think they're gonna make their first watchdogs free with that uh, play at home stuff. Yeah, that'd be good actually. Okay, so what's this? I found a creature egg, a boomerang fish, small edible prey fish. Okay. Are you removed some of these? Let's see what happens to the other guys real quick. See if they're still streaming or something. Seems like Jetpack might be gone too. I 
Sorry guys, I'm back. Alright, so... Let's see, so... I'll have a look at some more stuff. So I found some metal, which is good. So I don't know what we're using that for just yet. Seek fluid intake immediately. Seek fluid intake immediately? Hmm. I guess that means water. Got some more metal salvage. The thing I'm unsure about is I might have to purify water, which I didn't mean. So it probably needs to be drinkable. So maybe what I should do... Save this game where it is now. What I'll do is we'll try the creative side of this game. See how we do with a creative game. Because creative looks a little easier to deal with. Let's try this out. Alright, so let's try out start a new game and let's try creative mode. With no worries. Let's see how we do with creative mode. I'm not sure what creative mode is gonna be like. So I'm pretty sure you could make like a, is it underwater, like, base, like the, like the thing we were in. I'll try and craft one of those and see what I can put in it. This could take a while, so. Oh, never mind. Alright, so... The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Okay, so how do I... Guide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. The builder, too is designed to construct habitats capable of withstanding extreme environmental conditions. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Motivational note. Craig McGill crash landed in the acid swamps of Boreal 9, fought off thoracic kidney poachers, and hijacked a tamed Star Wars. If you can do all that, you can survive one more day. The Aurora Mobile suffered vehicle, a little pile failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Oh, what the hell? Vehicle bay. The sea moth is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. actually build a room for this thing.
You need to go to a large depth to make some of the vehicles construction tool. Wait, so how do I make that, dude? Do I need like like yeah, you know, like one of those underwater like bases? So do I need like? So how would I do that to like start one then? I'm doing it through um, the thing, by the way. Habit builder, go to your inventory. Uh, okay. Habit builder, see. Okay. Let me grab that real quick. Whoa! It's got flung right into the water. Ah, okay. Observatory. Alright, so what should I start with first then? Uh, dude, because, um, obviously I'm new to this game. What do I need to build, like, for the base of this thing? Purpose room. Basic room. Um, is that in here? Basic room. Am I looking for that or is that. Have I got a craft set item? Multi-purpose room, let's have a look. Uh I'm gonna pull multi-purpose. Ah, okay, so this thing's gonna go underground a little bit. Pull underground, underwater. Okay, so is that where's that gone? Is that craft? Where did that go, did it? Is it gotta be looking a fat surface or something? <laughs> Let me try to do that again. I'm a little confused. It doesn't look like it's placing anything. I think it's X. Oh. Oh yeah, you might be right actually. Ah, there we go, yeah. Okay, that's good, right. So that's... Here. Alright, what do I need to do next for this thing? Do I need a connector to go this thing now? Place a hatch. Okay. So if I go onto that. Oh no no no! I need that. I need that. Give me that thing. Need the hatch. He said, "Huh? Let's have a look. Where's the hatch piece? Radio locker." There's a hatch in... What's the hatch? Oh, here. Ah, yes, I see. Okay. Now, how do I place this on this thing? Oops, I actually took a screenshot. Oh, it has to go on the side. Okay. Ah, I gotcha. Okay. Right, let's head inside this thing. Don't even need to keep taking screenshots. Welcome ah, there we go. Captain. Looking nice. 
Alright, thank you very much for the assistance, man. Game Whispering also got Subnautica today. Yeah, definitely pick up Subnautica, guys, but I forgot to mention that. Make sure you pick this up, it's free. Um, so, what should I put in here now? Do I need, like, an essential item? Let's see. Do I need, like, a livable thing in here? Like, a... A counter or something? Oh, do I need another room with... I can put, like, a bed and something in. Horizon Zero is the one that's gonna be free. Okay. Place things like a bed and radio. Okay, what what shall I extend this as then? Shall I make another room going somewhere else? What shall I do? I think f I'll do for this area though, since we got a start going. Windows? Okay, so I think I had to do the window part. Oh, that's cool. I like this. Oh, that's cool. Let's have another one uh, on this side here, shall we? Let's put one here. Oh, that's cool. I like this. And then, let's see what else. Should we make a room? On this side, like this. We should put a hatch here, shouldn't we? Oh, can I not do that? Make a moon pool room. Okie dokie, moon pool. Why is this blue thing here? Why glitch that out? Oh, hold on a second. I think I might need to exit this thing for a second. Yo, what's up, Jonah? Just playing some Subnautica, bro. I'm streaming it, by the way, if you're interested in coming and say hello to the stream. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent that. with damage to the Aurora's drive core um. sustained during planet fall. So I'm a little confused. Do I need to place a hatch here? No, it's the first time I'm actually playing it. I don't understand like, what I'm doing at all. Oh, here you go, so here's the, here's, here we go, that's done. Alright, if you can place a moon pool, look at the blue stairs. And then you need to fully craft it. Oh, okay. That's why the stairs were appearing. So let me craft a moon pool, like you said, real quick. Let's have a look, see what this thing does. Oh, wait, this thing's an outside thing? Oh, okay. Let me exit the base, and then we'll place one of these outside. Not gonna lie, this may be the first base, but it's looking pretty good so far. Huh? Okay, I'm confused what the moon pool... Um... I think I need a bit more rundown of how the moon pool works, it looks like a large building, from what I can tell. You need to make a connector. Is that one of the tube things? Glass component connector. Ooh. You know, Jonah, you should come watch the stream, bro. I'm not even kidding. I think Dallas and Ethan were moaning at me and uh, JJ. I think they both moaned at us. Yeah. Basically, because I because because you know I'm playing some mods to go right now, and I'm doing it um, without any help. I've got this guy in my stream right now helping me out, and JJ's not here, so uh, 
Um, we need to make a connector. Wait, what? Where do I need to put the connector, though? What kind of connector? Do I need this one? Or do I need... Connect. Where's the connector? Connector. Am I missing it? Confused. Deconstruct the glass to make room for the compartment. Oh, okay. Alright, I'll deconstruct that real quick then. And then we'll do is it need the glass one, don't we? Uh just go a little bit further back. There we go. Okay, I'm liking it. Go in here. We need a hatch, don't we, for this? We can leave that. Um, so, what do I need to do now that I've got one of these tube connectors? Do I make this longer, or do I like add the, that room you said? I do not know how to do any of these things. I just went in and played it. Same. Yeah, this got this guy Will is being really helpful. So I appreciate you being in the stream, man. I, I've never played this game before. It's nice. It's nice having a bit of assistance. A uh, game I'm not very familiar with. So yeah, what do I need to do with this then? Do I need to like put the moon pool thing down that you said? Place the moon pool on the connector. I don't think it's let me place it. Do I have to place it like on the ground somewhere? Oh, on it's so let me place it now. Why is it let me... Oh, is it because it's like... Okay, let me try to place it... Here. Right, okay, so let me place it now, but I think it was because it was like out of the way. Ah, okay. Alright, so I've got it placed down now, bro. Alright, so what's this? This is a hatch to get into this place. That. Or take the moon pool. I think it's let me do it. Hold on, let me try that again. Uh, where is it? After face? weeks without human contact, it is normal to experience psychological discomfort. Research indicates symptoms may be partly alleviated by adopting a pet or anthropomorphizing an inanimate object. Okay, so there we go with that. Is that going to be able to connect to this? I have to move it a bit more. Will that be okay, do you think? I'll take the moon pool under. Wait, what do you mean under? Enter from under. Okay. Oh yeah, you can. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh jeez. Lag quite a bit there. Okay. 
Okay, so we're inside of this thing, but is it, is it not very really lined up with the actual base itself? How do I now connect this to the thing here? Do I have to put a hatch onto it or no? Shout out, Jonah. <laughs> uh, let's see. So I can't really connect it this way. this together. I have to go now. Maybe you have a stream if I have to time to watch it. Remove the other hatch. Okay, remove the hatch. And then connect the L compartment with it. Is that what I should do? Let me see here. So if I do this glass component so I can see outside while I'm traveling across to it. It's hard to connect, I'm not gonna lie. Move the glass part and use an L. What, the corner piece again? Is that what you mean by the L? Alright, if I... Move both of these then, and then do...
hit, but that needs to be removed. It's not allowing me access to it. They are different heights, it won't work. So remove the multi-purpose room and place it back. Uh, the multi-purpose room. Oh, wait a minute. I think it's connected on. I think it connected on. Wait, just one second. I think it connected that time. Right, so if I climb up into here, our moon pool's connected up to this. Let's see if it's connected up this side. Yes, there we go. All right, perfect. All right, that's brilliant. Now, Jono, if you look at what I've just taken me ages to do, I've got the um connection. No, I've got the con I've got the uh, moon pool connected to the main moi thing now. Okay, now we now we're getting somewhere. All right, thank you very much, man. That's really helpful. Finally got somewhere in the end. We've made a full room connect together. Now, what else can we do? So, uh, yeah, go ahead and keep explaining uh, what I should put down next. What's this thing do? Observatory. A bed and like a radio. Can I put like a room for that or no? How do I make like a room for a bedroom or should I just use this as a bedroom? Let's put... What's the observatory do? Oh, that's cool. Hold on, I've got an idea. With a specific I have an idea for this. In mind, observatories and other glass I have an idea for this one. For survival purposes. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. Put that the wrong way. Oh, let me deconstruct that. Alright, so is that. No, it's not connected that way. Whoops. Or I'll keep fucking up. Um, trying to face it so it's. Same way. Keep pressing R2, sorry man. Keep doing a bit wrong. Right, there we go. And then if I then do... If I then do a glass tunnel... Connecting... That have that for the time being there, and then if we get the observatory, there we go. And then if we also get now a 
Let's see, a multi-purpose room, I think it is. Now place this like slightly over this way. Um, we should get to place a bedroom somewhere. All right, there we go. It's looking good. All right, sorry to go ahead with everything, man. No, I didn't mean to skip ahead. You can go ahead and explain what I should do after I've done this. I just had a little idea. Oh god, it's lagging a bit. Oh my god, it's lagging. Alright, so let's go check out our observatory, shall we? Alright, so this is our observatory. Now that looks amazing. It's a very small room, don't don't mind that, but damn this thing looks so cool. Get some really nice views in here. Put a catch on the top of the bottom of the corridor. Oh, I thought you said corridor. Uh, yeah, I guess we could do that. Right, I'll tell you what we're going to do with this place. We can have some windows in here. And then... Have two windows there. Let's see, so we want a bedroom in here. Quilted double bed. Okay, I'm liking this, man. Alright, so we've got the first furniture piece. I'll tell you what I'm going to do, though. I'm actually going to remove this window at the back here have this window here and then let's see what else we can have in here. Trash can, wall planter, wall shelves, nuclear waste disposal, this chair. That's not really on the wall, is it? That's a wall locker. Hold on, let me... Aquarium? Wait, you can have a fucking aquarium in here? Wait, let me... Oh, that's cool. You can have a full-on aquarium in here. Can you both fish in this thing? Use aquarium. Oh wait, hold on. Use aquarium. I need a fish to go in here, don't we? Um. Okay, I'm not sure how you put fish in here yet. I'll have to figure that out a little bit more. You can make an alien containment in one room. You know, I actually will do that soon when we get somewhere with this. But yeah, so far we've managed to make a decent room um, extension. I'm confused how you put fish in that thing though. Okay, I'm not really sure about that then. Power cell charger, fabric uh, radio. Let's 
place a med kit station in the, the bedroom as well. Never know when you might need a med kit. Uh, place one on each side. Uh, that looks good to me. So we got a fish tank and a few med kits in here. Find a fish in the ocean. Oh, you can't place them from in here. Okay. I think what I'm gonna do... Is there not... And we can put a hatch up here, can't we? Uh, how does a ladder work? I guess you can't put a ladder like that. How do I put a hatch going upwards? Can I not do that? on the connectors, okay. Well, I guess what we want to do now is exit this place and begin making another room. But, before we exit out of this room, I believe there's a boat we can put in here. Yep, Jono was here just a moment ago. I think my boat's outside somewhere, I have to look for it real quick. Ah, oh, there it is. I think I see it, actually. Yeah, that's it there, the sea muff. Let's grab this. I wonder where Tyler's even at. I haven't heard him for a while. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, shit. I'm a terrible fucking underwater pilot. Okay, that's cool. So when you park, or when you deliver a vehicle into this area, it actually stations it in the air for you, like above the water. Oh, that's cool. Moonpool. Yeah, so if you want to look at my stream, JJ, I've actually made uh, a few decent rooms at the moment. Yeah. But it's just to learn me the game a bit better. Once I play probably the game a bit more with resources, that's when it's probably going to be a bit harder to fucking... Survive it. No, no, no. Um, so I guess from the moon pool you can't really connect anything else. Am I maybe lying to myself? Can you place a hatch going to another room? It's trying to connect to something outside, but I don't know why it'd want to do that. Okay, I think what we'll do. This next side will have some glass connectors going across. Oh, can I not connect it to this bit? I think I'm going to need a hatch. I can't seem to place it on this side. That's weird. Why can't I place it? What the 
hell was that? Basic compartment. Don't crash into your base or flood. Something is in the room blocking. It is. I don't think there was anything in the room blocking anything, was there? You have to air rape like that. Um, let's see. Like the bed. Wait, so I can't place anything over here even though that's what it's caused. Can I not place anything going diagonally? Two compartments you need to use a T. How's that? <laughs> I'm confused as to why nothing's connecting anymore. Nothing won't connect. I'm confused what's going on. Um, I'm confused, man. I'm not really sure what's going on. Place the thing you're trying to connect it to. You mean this? Is that why it's not doing anything? There we go. I'm gonna extend it going this way a little bit more. And if I make a T compartment. Local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours.
Let's make us oh shit, the scanner is massive. Okay, I think what I'll do with this is I'll just disconnect this real quick. If I disconnect this. No, let me construct that and then make it one tube bigger. Then switch the route for it. Going this way. Let me try and place the scanner room now. No, the scanner room can't be placed for some reason. It can up here, but why up here is it let me place it? that thing do? When the AI thinks is excuse me, go to the top of the pod. On this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. How do I access this room? We need to iron try. Alright, so if I make... is there a hatch this way? No, there isn't. I'll tell you what I do. We'll leave that bit for now. Because you said about the computer we need to go to in a minute. So I'm going to check that out and see what that means in a moment. Because you said that's quite important. Oh shit, bro, the lag is crazy right now. Alright, let's have a look though. Let's see what this other room is. Camera one. Okay, so we've got a full fledged room system now. There's a fish trapped in the. Congratulations How did survivor. you get in here? You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. Data indicates that swimming was Wait, your the? favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. Oh shit. Something didn't go right. 
Oh wait, no, that's... That's not the part, is it? No, it's this part over here. Oops, my bad, it connects this way. Oh! I thought it didn't connect correctly then. Ah, okay, here we go. How is this place supposed to be? Okay, we'll deal with this bit in a minute. Camera one. Oh, we need cameras set up. I haven't got any cameras by the looks of it. We'll take the scanner room. That's the local mop. Wait, do I really need to look rotate it though? Is it is it not okay the way it is? You do have you do have camera. Is it in here somewhere, or is it in the actual thing? I'm a bit confused. Uh, unless you mean on the f on the watching record, then I can get that. What's this thing do? A reliable power source is a critical step towards self-sufficiency. Consider Inactive. keeping a photo journal of your achievements to motivate you in times of despair. I have no idea what this thing is, but it looks quite uh, important to this ship. Why am I lagging so much? Oh yeah, it does show cameras. Yeah, never mind. <clears throat> so asking me to do of them though. Pick up the camera drone. Wait, why are these cameras all the way over here? Are these pieces? So we made we made the multi-purse scanner removal pool observatory. I need the observatory to be placed back. Just plant this back here. It's a bit in the way and it's a bit kind of close, but that's fine. Let's have a look at this thing from above. This thing is looking pretty good. Got quite a few rooms connected with it now. So, I need to know what that AI was talking about just a moment ago. I didn't pay attention to it much. She said something about two, like it was going to happen in two hours or something. What do I need to do? Is that like something I need to should be worried about? Don't worry. Okay. Just be ready to look at the crash ship. 
Why should I be looking at the crash ship though? What's gonna happen to it? Is it gonna explode or something? Whoa. What is going seven, on? Six, is that shit gonna explode? Five, four, three, two. What the fuck? that thing just explode again? What just happened to that thing? Sheesh. Stay here for a minute while it turns to day again. <laughs> Jesus. Or did that thing just explode again? It's kind of nuts to be honest. Yes, it is a big room now. It is more radioactive than. <laughs> Damn. All right, so let's uh, continue on then. Guess we don't want to be going any over there anytime soon. I'll tell you what we need to do. If I disconnect this thing. Oh shit what am I doing? Struck that back. Okay, we're going to start extending the base more this way now. It's also time for some glass walls. Oh, okay, wait a minute, we haven't got enough room. Sheesh, um, we're going to have to rotate re 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 this, rotate this thing a little bit then. Actually, wait, no, no. Use that, we got the other one. There we go. I am loving these glass component parts. So make a bit connection this way again, and then we'll think we'll leave it this for this way at the moment. But let's start replacing this little bit of glass. I think I accidentally placed something down here. Let me have a look what happened. There you go. Chuck that, and then make that the glass one. There we go, that looks really cool. Oh wait, hold on a second. That can't be possible actually. That's gonna have to go back, because that was a... TP 
piece. Damn it, that would have been cool if I could have placed that though. Got no second area though. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie, the, mic this, the music kind of reminds me of Minecraft the way it's playing right now. I'm not sure about you guys, but I'm just kind of getting some Minecraft sort of vibes from this music. It's as if like some of the developers from Minecraft worked on this game and made some music for it. Alright. So... I'm gonna need to make a hatch going out this way. Go back out and do that though. Let me remove this real quick and then make that connect this way. Alright, here we go. When making hatches inside... Wait. When making hatches inside... Point A... Oh, okay. Thanks for the tip, man. I will keep that in mind. Oh, anyway, let me go back in here. We can start making some rooms for this place, finally. It's laggy a little bit, though. Alright, let's see. So we got this thing, which I'm not really sure what the hell this thing does yet, which we'll probably figure it out as we go along. And what I've decided to do is just connect this piece to this big room here, and then that way it just connects the room and the corridors easier. I think we need something in this observatory, I think. Let's see. Let's place... Uh, Place a counter. Make sure I can get out of it this way. Yeah, sounds good to me. Can we move the chair just a little bit closer? Um. Yeah, there we go. Then.
which you can't really place on something on the desk, but there you go. Be a good place to work and do stuff here. Actually, hold on, you make sure it's a bit centered because that's, that's not very centered. Let me just make sure it is. It's hard to get it centered by the looks of it though. Did it the wrong way. That's good enough. All right, let's see here. I think for this next room, I'm gonna do what you said about this alien container thing. Nuclear reactor, alien containment. Uh, how the fuck do you? Pr oh. Aquariums provide an ideal opportunity to study alien fauna up close. Select carefully which life oh, okay. forms you bring on board. They may also be studying you. It's like a giant fish tank then. But nothing connected this way yet, so we're gonna leave that. And I think this is also non connect not connected to anything, so yeah, this is kind of this area done. You need a hash to go in. Oh, you need a hash to go in this thing? You can go in that thing? The hell? Use planter. Ah, okay, you can have fish in here. Well, that's cool. We've got a pet fish. I mean, he's not in the fish tank, but he won't be deadly, I'm sure. He's just a harmless little fish. <laughs> Hope you enjoy your stay, buddy. You're like the only guy I have on here at the moment. Let's see, so have I got... Where's the thing gone? Shit, where did I... Oh, shit. Where has other oh, go that is Habitat Builder? Well, I hope you enjoy your stay in there, bud. I'll probably come in and join you one day. Let's see. I think what we need is a central kitchen. Call him Gary. I think we'll call him Gary, that sounds like a good idea. Yeah, we'll call that fella down there Gary. We will call him Gary. Um, let's see. So this just leads me to the scanner room. Now, what can you do in here, Fabricator? Camera drone. How do I work the cameras then? I don't think I have any of the cameras activated. Kinda of reminds me of Among Us a little bit this game in the way it gives these weird sound wipes off.
press to control the drones. I don't think I have them activated. I think I took them off. It's not let me use them. I'm not sure if I actually took them away from something. See, I think I should be able to make a hatch from out here. There we go, we can make a hatch going outwards. How do I put them back? Can't I put them back here? A camera. Does this thing belong outside by any chance, or does this not belong outside? This thermal thing? What's this thing supposed to do? I'm just not sure what the hell it does. The hell, why is the camera falling down? The camera just fell down. Come back here, camera. Ah, shit, I lost the camera. Where are you, camera? I can't even see where it's gone. I think I have a flashlight somewhere. Ah, here we go. Haven't used this tool yet. Why did it fall off? Is it not attached properly? Fell plant is for underwater volcanoes. Ah. So that's kind of useless for me at the moment then. I don't really need this, but I mean, I guess I could keep it here. Shark like thing called stalkers you steal them sometimes. Power transmitter. Does this thing not function under water? Let's see what this thing does. I have no idea what 
idea what I'm doing from here on out. Just place a few of these down. They look to be supplying power to the base. Let's place a few more down. What do these things do? Do they just power up the satellite or the, the solar panels? You can extend your habitat's power far away so you can power things like floodlights. Ah! Floodlights. I don't know if it's a good idea placing these on top. Ah! Place one of these down here. Okay, so what's it doing? Is it f oh, it's flashing this way still. Okay, let's place a few more of these electrical things down. Here we go. a few more down so it's got like a quite a lot of power next to it. Okay that's now being powered. I'm not sure what it's powered for exactly though. What I might actually do so if I remove this Actually, a better idea for this thing. Is it facing this way still? I guess it was facing that way when I placed it. Let's have a light coming from both sides. <coughs> if placing 
Oh, it's not powered? Oh. Wait a minute, couldn't I do that by putting one of these down here? I guess they aren't powered down here still. Never mind. I think this is looking pretty good so far. Just need a few more windows in it. Venom machine in here. Yeah, <laughs> thanks very much, man. Much appreciate it. <laughs> For a new player, I didn't think I'd be doing that good. Um, what's a wall plan to do? Single wall shelf. I presume I actually have to put this on a wall instead of something else. Shelves. How the hell do these things work? Oh, I guess there's not enough room for it to be put in there. I can't put these inside of here, but that's fine. Oh, you can set a picture. Oh, that's cool. Oh, you just messaged me on PlayStation. I thought you find my name. I mean, if it's because of my PSN, I understand. Hold on a second, I'm gonna need to remove this table real quick. So if I put one. Over there, then put the table down there. I'm amazing. Okay, but you're amazing, hacker man. Wait, what? I'm confused. <laughs> trash can. The hell kind of trash can is this? Huh? 
Oh, I mean, I can see where they come from when it says trash can now. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a second. Oh, okay, they're wall shelves. Maybe that's why they won't like a ground at him. You mean that in a sarcastic way, dude, or no? Is that, is that what you mean by Hagerman or something when you found my name? Confused? No, I'm a white hat. Don't worry. What do you mean by that? I'm not. Conf I'm. I'm confused. YouTube. Oh, I was gonna say I thought you were hacking me. Then I was gonna be like, oh, yeah, please don't hack me, bro. <laughs> What do you mean by black hat? I'm confused.
she's in the wa- Wait, that is, is... No, she's back outside. Do you know what way? Oh. I think I can hear a bit more. Yeah, bro, please don't hack me, okay? <laughs> I worked really hard to get this YouTube channel and stuff. I recently just set 500 subs, if you were wondering, by the way, as well. So, yeah. I've, uh, got this channel pretty far where it is right now. What's this thing do? Vehicle upgrade console. Oh, shit. Is that thing? How's that thing doing here? That makes it a loud ass noise. That thing does. It's all good. I have like 32 subs. Yeah, please don't hack me, bro. Uh, just. You sound like a cool guy because uh, you just helped me out with uh, Southern Walker a lot and I greatly appreciate it. Didn't know much about Southern Walker and when until you came along you've been really helpful. It's about time we also really quickly. Where is it? This way. Started reconnecting. Let's take this off real quick. Um, how do I disconnect this again? So you could just oh wait a minute must be because this is on top of it oh yeah there we go that does make a bit more sense actually I was wondering why you could disconnect that for a second One 
second. So, sorry about going inactive just for a second there. Um, so, oh, it's daytime. So, if I. I do want to make more hatch stuff. I feel like there's a lack of getting inside of this base at the moment. You know what we're going to do? Well, that's a hatch. We're going to make a hatch to get inside some of these areas a bit easier. Right, here you go. We're going to get in the hatch. I'm going to make a bit of an easier access point to some of these areas. Because I've realised I've only got like one or two hatches around here. Alright, so this is now fully connected to the other side. That's brilliant. Let's put some windows in here. Man, I love this game's development. I don't think we're going to be continuing this on for too much longer guys, because obviously we've done this for quite a while now. Uh, but basically we'll probably do like a bit more of an expansion to this. So, um, obviously I'm prob I don't know how big you can probably make these things, but I want to see how possibly big you can make one. Have like a fully fledged, uh, maybe like a fully fledged fish tank room or something with aliens and shit inside. Although Gary's gonna be alone for a while, aren't you, Gary? <laughs> You're a weird looking fish. Not, I'm not, I don't think I've ever seen a fish with an eye in the middle of its body before. But I guess that's uh, a bit different to Gary, I guess, you know. Gary's just one of them unique fish. And I did put the hatch there, fuck. Let me put the hatch back there real quick. Oh, I forgot. Oh, you can run in this game. Wow, I've, I'm so stupid. I was some of them walking and they realized you could run. Yoink out of here. Oh, hold on a second. I have to deconnect this piece. Okay. That's 
there. Alright, if I quickly go to this side and jump in this hole here, you can put them on the roof. Well, you can put roof and bottom. Wait, what's those? Do you mean the hatches? If that's what you mean, then I'm not really sure, but just explain anyway. <laughs> Boss man Gary. <laughs> Gary, I don't know what kind of fish you are, but honestly, you're a you're very unique fish. For a second, I thought that thing was in the fucking um, in here for a minute. Well, let's see here then. So this bit here, for the time being, we're probably going to keep like that. Over here, we can probably start adding some of these other bigger rooms. Water. F what the hell does this thing do? Oh, this thing has to be placed near a wall. What's this thing do? Water filtration machine. Ah, okay, so this is how you get clean water. I apologize for Night Boss spam uh, timing you out, bro. I don't know why he did that. I need to get time I need to get Nightbot fully thingy in manual save only. Okay. I have to get I have to get my friend to sort out a note because I'm not sure why he keeps timing out people like that. He shouldn't do that. Why can't I place this thing down? Build in the moon pool to up Oh! Build in the moon pool to upgrade dog to vehicles. Oh! Okay, so that cannot be placed anywhere else. Gotcha. Ah, okay, gotcha. Bioreactor. I think I've already got one of these things. Oh, you can put hatches on the top of... Ah, oh, okay. I got you. Let me see if that works. Wait, let me do it up here. If I... Do one here... Afterwards, there we go. If I remove that, like that, and then just jump into here again. Oh, that's handy. Now, let's see what it looks like. If I oh, that's cool. That's cool. I like that. Let's place one at the bottom here as well. So if we want to get out both ways, we can go down here with this, and then we want to come back in. Let's go with the joint, back up and do that. Oh, that's a lot of fun. Gary is a peeper. Yes. Gary is a very unique looking fish in my opinion. He's uh, it's a strange looking fish, aren't you Gary? I don't know what humans would name you, especially the species. <laughs> I guess peeper is what you'd be called though, because I guess that's what your species is. But let's find Gary a friend though. So we can find a friend. What's this guy? That guy scared the fucking shit out of me. Um, we need to find Gary a friend. Come here, piece of shit. Can I not? I can't get you, big fish. Get, get, hey! What the fuck, man? Where'd that guy just go? Back, you piece of shit. Alright, I think I've got a friend for Gary now. Okay, we're at the scanner room. I think I managed to find Gary a friend. Okay, so if I just go to the inventory. Okie dokie, Gary, we got you, uh, this very sad looking fella. 
place you in here. There you go, buddy. You got a friend. Now we need a name for the uh, boomerang guy. How you doing in there, buddy? You enjoying it? You got a friend now. We got him a friend. I don't know what to call the boomerang fella. What'd be cool this guy? I need a name for this fella. We got Gary the pe we got Gary the peeper and uh, the boomerang fella. I'm not sure what the fuck you just teleported. I'm gonna try and find Gary some more friends. Let's see what else we can find out here. Anything else? Useful things. Alien life force oh, alien. may have unexpected alien. applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Coming in here, buddy. Gary, you got another friend. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck this guy is. There you go, buddy. We now got three different fish in there. See, Gary, you made friends. Although, I just don't know what to call this guy. I have no idea what kind of fish that is. You can get fish eggs and put them in. That's how you get big fish. Ooh, Alex Jones. <laughs> we need to remember these names, I'm not going to lie. I'm not sure who the f What kind of fish breed is this? It's a weird looking fish, that one is. See, Gary, you've got some more friends. See if I can find you some more. Try and get all different fish in here together. Let's see. What hell are you? Can I get you? No. Doesn't seem like you want to be collected, do you? have one of you guys. Need to find a different fish. How did you just go? I just see something different, I think. Oh, that's a peeper, no. Don't know how many different types of fish there even are still. Looks like these are the ones you can find at the moment. Oh, what's this guy? Get back here, you piece of shit. What is your name? Is that a catfish? What the hell are you? Come here, you small fucker. Gotcha. What the fuck are you, a snail? This guy has some extremely long eyes by the looks of it. Alright. Coming over to my fish pen, do you understand? You shall be interrogated. You shall tell me why you are on this planet. And many other things. Don't know what the hell you are, but let's put you in with these guys. There you go, buddy. You're free. Alright, we found four different types of fish. A peeper, whatever the fuck that thing is. A boomerang and a snail type thing. I have no idea what the hell you are. <laughs> the third one is called a bladderfish. Wait, the orange one or the the pinkish? This one here, the one that's like near the sand. Making some good progress with these fish right now. I wonder how many more we can find. Can you go 
guys definitely not be collected. You guys seem very interested, and that's the problem. What the hell are you? Ooh, you look pretty. What a nice colourful girl you are. I think I want you for my fish tank. How many more of these guys exist down here? Is there any more of them? What a nice colourful fish you are. Well, I can't fish like you exist in real life. Creature egg? Hmm, found an egg, okay. This fish actually tastes like fish, dehydrating, but keeps well. I mean, I think I like him. Let's put this guy in here, shall we? Here you go, guys, you've got a nice color, colorful neighbor here with you too. What a nice color that thing is. Well, the rest of them could go in my fish tank. <laughs> The one near the sand? Oh, okay. Alright, we'll take this thing to my room. Go put this in my fish tank. I like these things. These things are nice and colourful. These things will be nice for a little... little fish tank place. You guys are colourful. I wonder if I could find you in regular survival. You guys don't look too hard to find. Just have to search for you kind of deep below the water by the looks of it. Alright. How do I do how do I want to release one of these fish? Okay, now they go in there. Oh okay, so it's R2 to release them into the fish tank. Okay. What exactly are you supposed to be? Um, what the fuck is this? Am I holding a fucking lizard or a frog? <laughs> the fuck is this thing? What the hell happened to you? Were you once a lizard or something? Like half a lizard and half a frog and then this is what happened to you? What the hell is wrong with you? What are you called? A hoverfish? What the hell is a hoverfish? Curved hoverfish. The crispy salty legs are the highlight. Dehydrating, but it keeps well. Okay. Well, you've also got this strange fella here. Um, guys, so enjoy him. Honestly, I got more and more confused with each fish I've collected. But there are some massive collections now. We got this weird looking guy who just keeps teleporting. Here's a sound. We've got this nice colourful fish. This weird motherfucker with those eyes. This guy who looks like he's just grown like seven legs. Peep just got a nice body. And where's the other one? The boomerang. Boomerang's the only one that looks kind of normalish, I guess, apart from the peeper. But yeah, we got a massive fish tank collection. <laughs> this is going well, to be honest. Didn't think it would.
what a nice fish we have here. Well, I think this will do it for the time being. But before I do end off stream, maybe, let's have a look and see how big the space has got. This place has actually got pretty damn big. I love how big this place has got. Like it started off so small. Now it's like an underwater community. Ah, uh, like whatever the hell that thing is, I'm still unsure. We got this place. Uh, what the hell is this place again? That's the bedroom, isn't it? Uh, yeah, that's the bedroom. This place is the scanner, like the camera maintenance room. This place is like the small little office area. Down there is the fish tank aquarium, where all the big fish are stored. 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 Uh, what was in here? I can't remember what I put in this room again. I think that's the water filtration area. But yeah, I think we did quite a bit in the stream. Which is good because we can definitely continue this on. I'm not sure how big we can make this, but it could definitely become quite big. <laughs> Maybe extend that um, office area going that way a bit more so it's in the center sure what to do with it just yet because that center area is not really being used up yet or what I could do actually uh, where is it what's this connected to is it connected to anything uh, no, I think it is but we can just disconnect it real quick Be good then. Yeah. I 
Alright guys, I think that's gonna do it for today's stream. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you like, subscribe and share for more Subnautica streams. What did you just say? Yeah, damn right you f- Oh. I was gonna say, I thought you said something about rape.